Hello and welcome to Oki Data Australia. In today's short video we are going to cover the installation of the wireless card and connection to a wireless network on Oki MFP and printer devices. The wireless card is located on the right hand side of the machine. Open the cover and the door can be removed from the machine. Connect the wireless card when you install it into the machine, make sure the back of the card is behind the locating plates. Simply press the front of the card, unlock into position, then replace the door and close it. To enable the wireless card, power on the MFP or printer device. Press device settings, then scroll down to admin setup. Press admin setup and enter the administrator password. Press OK after the password is entered. Scroll down to user install. Then scroll down to wireless module. Press the wireless module, then press the enable button. Press the back menu several times to get back to the home screen. Then power off the device. When you power the device back on, it should automatically ask you to set up the wireless card. Once again, enter the administrator password and press OK. You'll receive a note saying there is two modes for the wireless card, infrastructure and access point. In this video, we will use the infrastructure mode Press wireless network selection. The device will then scan the network for your closest Wi-Fi access point. Choose the appropriate access point name, then enter the password for that access point. Confirm they have correct details and the device should then connect to the access point. Press the close button. You should now see a Wi-Fi symbol on the control panel. By default, an IP address will be allocated automatically to your device. However, we recommend that the device be set with a static IP address. We will now go through this procedure. Press the device settings button and scroll down to admin setup. Enter the admin password then scroll down to network menu, press network setup, press network setting, change the IP address to manual and you will see the current IP address. If required, use the up and down arrows or the keypad to change this address and enter the appropriate subnet mask. One thing to note is IPv6 should be disabled unless absolutely required. Press the close button, then press the back button to get back to the menu. The network will then reinitialize and you are ready to print and scan over the network. Thank you for watching our video. If you have any further questions or do not have a CD drive attached to your computer, all of the drivers and user manuals can be downloaded from our website at www.oki.com.au.